step 20. We are getting so close. We're getting so, so close. Now we need to work on that faith muscle. We're going to work on it from today until the rest of our lives so that it can be as strong as everything. It can be the strongest thing that people remember about us. It can be the thing that sets us apart and shows miracles do happen. It's all about faith. God wants to know, where is your faith? How much faith do you have? How much? You only need the amount of a mustard seed to get started, to get started to witness your first miracle. But I'm going to tell you, the more faith that you have, me. The bigger that faith bubble grow, the bigger that mustard seed get just out of control to the point that you have so much faith in your entire being that it's so hard to even allow a negative thought to come in. You're there. But the way to allow that faith to grow to that magnitude, to that amount, is for everything. Let me make sure this microphone is up. Yep, it's up. Everything. Not most things, not a lot of things, not some things. I'm talking about everything. You need to thank God. You need to thank God. If it was for something that happens that you weren't expecting, you know, You're in traffic, you're trying to get over, and traffic is so backed up and nobody's letting you over, but one person stops and says, come on, come on out. Thank them, of course, but when you get out into the traffic safely and on your way, you say, thank you, God. Everything. Everything that someone else did for you that they didn't have to do, which is everything, be thankful for it because they didn't have to do it. Every surprise that you receive, be thankful for it. Thank God for it because the more you thank God, the more God wants to give to you. This ain't rocket science. This don't take no college degree. You ain't even got to think about this. This is even below common sense. This is one of those, it is what it is. The more you thank God with all of your heart, Because you are exercising the faith that everything that you need, everything that you deserve, everything that is for you is coming from God. And you ain't even got to get involved in it. In fact, God prefers if you Don't get involved because God said every time you get involved, stuff gets messed up. Chick goes left. So 
God said, let him work it out. If you don't mind. If you don't mind. And when we allow God to work it out, whatever it is, I mean, you know, we have to ask God to work it out and then take the steps needed to to allow God to put the people in our path, to put the situations in our path, to to align whatever it is that we need up. So we have to work towards it, but God will deliver it. We just have to have that faith. We have to always be in the spirit of thanks giving. 